it's funny. Like I, there were definitely times where I would get probably more annoyed than I should have in a radio studio. And one of the things that would drive me insane was when there were people in the studio and phones were ringing and not being answered. Oh yes. That was like, that was my biggest pet peeve. Cause I was just, I just sat there going, that's someone that took time out of their day. And we're not doing a contest. It's someone that's just calling. Mm-hmm. How are we not trying to answer? And sometimes it's impossible because if you have a great topic or something and you've only got three people in a studio, usually, and you're lucky today if you have three people in the studio, so you can't get to every call, but at least make the attempt. Yeah. You know, and I think one of the reasons uh, you talked about this before, like we have this really great audience on, uh, on Twitch that's followed us since we got let go. But the crazy thing is, and I don't know whose secrets are who, but You've got to remember that we used to do when we did Dirty Little Secret, they were legit people. And that's mm-hmm. our community. Like people appreciated the fact that we put them on the air. We protected their identity. We changed their voice. We gave them an outlet for things. Um, and that's part of our community, like because we treated people like people. 